Okay, this is a sets question from the 2020 Exam Craft Junior Third Higher Level paper. It's actually question 14. So it's a typical question which you'd see on sets. I'll, I'll put a picture, um, actually, I'll, I'll just, I'll, I wrote it out in big so we could get all the information clearly, but this is what you're given in the question. It says that in a survey of 70 teenagers, 30 liked Batman, which we denote as B, 26 liked Superman, which we denote as S, and 28 like Wonder Woman, which we denote as W. Then, 12 like Batman and Superman, 8 like Superman and Wonder Woman, but X, it says then, X liked Batman and Wonder Woman only. Now this is an important term, only. It's the first time we've seen the word only. And then it says, 4 liked all three. That's like the key bit of information for us, this all three, okay? But now this is the trickiest word part. Twice as many didn't like any of them as liked Batman and Wonder Woman only, which is the unknown quantity, okay? So let's move this to the side and I drew a small Venn diagram for you. Let's look here, okay? So we have a Venn diagram here and we say to ourselves, okay, how can we fill out this? Well, the first one we would always go to is the all three. So we can definitely fill in this in the middle section here and say four. Four definitely liked all three. Now let's look here. Let's work backwards and say, okay, we, we let's forget about this X for a minute. Well, we don't have to. X like Batman and Wonder Woman only. So let's go to the Batman and Wonder Woman only. It's this section here. It doesn't involve all three. The X goes in here. Eight like Superman and Wonder Woman. So it doesn't say only. So that means that Superman and Wonder Woman is in total eight. Now we know the four that make up all three is already part of these. So this is also four. So four and four make up this eight that we're looking for here. Twelve like Batman and Superman, which is all this section here, that makes up twelve and we already have a four. So this must be eight in here. So we're kind of ticked off as we go along what we have. So now 28 people in total liked Wonder Woman. So this whole section makes up 28. Yeah. So if you like, it's 28 minus all these three things. So for Wonder Woman, we actually have 28, or Wonder Woman only, right? We actually have 28 minus 4 minus another 4 minus an X. 28 minus 4 minus 4 is 20, and then minus X. Well, that just simply is actually 20 minus X, and I can't do any more with that. So in here is 20 minus X. That means if I add all these numbers together, I don't know what X is, I get 28. It says 26 like Superman. Well, we can see in the Superman section, we actually have all numbers, no X's. So Superman is going to be made up of, Superman only, he's going to be made up of the 26, and we're going to subtract the numbers that we know already, minus 4 and minus 4. So 8 and 4 is 12, another 4 is 16, 26 minus 16 leaves us 10. That means there's 10 in here, okay? So, so far so good, and 30 like Batman only. So let's take Batman only. This is not the notation you use, this is notation I'm just using here for you to help, help you understand. So Batman only, well, it says 30, so it's going to be 30, and we're going to subtract all the numbers we already have in the Batman um, section. So 30 minus 8 minus 4 minus x. So that's 30 minus 8 is 22, minus 4 is 18, and then minus x. That's simply 18 minus x goes in here. Okay? Now, one bit of information we're through here was this bit here. So what's going on with this bit here? It says twice as many didn't like any of them. So we know if you're not involved in any of these sections here, you're outside here. So what we put out here, well, let's say if we call that outside section Y, we can't call it X. We know that that Y is going to be twice as big as didn't like Batman and Wonder Woman only. Now the Batman and Wonder Woman only is, is X. So if the number out here is twice as big as that, what are we going to call it? Well, it's two times X, which literally is two X. So if that's two X, and we have everything here. So can we solve now this for x? Well, we can, because it said the survey was of 70 teenagers. So we actually know all these individual numbers here should all make up 70. So if I was to make out an equation, I, my equation looked like this, 18 minus x plus eight plus 10 plus four plus another four plus another x plus a 20 minus x 
plus this 2x out here, that should all equal to 70. So let's see what we can do here. Well, let's leave 18 minus x out the front. So 8 and 10 is 18, and 4 is 22, and 4 is 26. So those numbers in the middle are 26. Plus x, now plus 20 minus x plus 2x, still equal to 70. So we have a minus x and a plus x, they go. An 18 and a 26 and a 20, what do all they make up to? So 26 and 20 is going to be 46 and 8 is going to be 64 when we do the 18. So we have 64 for this number, this number and this number. And now we have a minus x and a plus 2x. Well, 2x minus x is just simply x and that's equal to 70. Now it's simply x is equal to 70. Let's bring this guy across. He makes minus 64. So x then must be equal to 6. It's done. So I hope you could see how I did that. I, I took it step by step. I wrote the numbers out in big to make this Venn diagram. We know 70 teachers were or 70 teenagers were surveyed makes u equal to 70. And then when we can start filling them in, always go to the all three one first. Put that in the middle and then start working your way through these numbers. Don't be afraid to use the X. But I think the hardest piece of information to work with here was this. Twice as many didn't like any of them as like Batman and Wonder Woman only. Well, we know that Batman and Wonder Woman only was X. So if the number outside is twice as big, that's 2X. And then we make, we only can make one equation. So we can make our one equation. And of course, we can only solve one equation for one variable. That's what we're looking for. That's it.